going to bring any black people to the stadium. Well, is it easy to say that? It's very easy for you to say that. For you to say that. I, I won't say that to anyone. I would never ask anyone not to bring someone based on race or okay. color okay. or culture. Okay. It's like saying, like, let's just persecute and kill all of the Jews. Oh, it's the same thing, right? Well, isn't it wrong? Wasn't it wrong then with the Holocaust? And you're Jewish. You understand you're, you're discrimination? You're really a mental case. The Holocaust we're comparing with racism, uh, discrimination. No racism here. If you don't want to be walking into a basketball game with a certain person, is that racism? <laughs> you, you think I'm a racist? And I don't think you're a racist. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. I think you you evil heart. I don't think so. I think you have an amazing heart, honey. I think the people around you have poisoned mind and have a way of thinking. It's the world. You go to Israel, the blacks are just treated like dogs. So do you have the, to treat them like that too? The white Jews, there's white Jews or black Jews. Do you understand? And are the black Jews less than the white Jews? 100%, 50, 100 And is that right? <laughs> there's no need to get upset. No need to get... I just see what, what I'm living with, what I'm do, dealing with. I'm sorry, I didn't do anything. You, know, you never do anything and never anything wrong. But I didn't do you anything. Upset me. You upset me. I have said crazy. you made yourself upset. No, that's not true. You, you didn't start off by saying, honey, I understand we're living in a culture. We can't Because I don't, just, I don't see your views. I, I wasn't raised the way you were well, raised. Well, if, if you don't feel, don't come to my games. Don't bring black people and don't come. Do you know that you have a whole team that's black that plays for you? You just, do I know? I support them and give them food and clothes and cars and houses. Who gives it to them? Does someone else give it to them? Do I know that I have? Who makes the game? Do I make the game or do they make the game? And these are 30 owners that created the league. Shortly after the release of an audio, audio recording this past Saturday morning of a conversation that allegedly included Clippers owner Donald Sterling, the NBA commenced an investigation, which among other things included an interview of Mr. Sterling. That investigation is now complete. The central findings of the investigation are that the man whose voice is heard on the recording and on a second recording from the same, from the same conversation that was released on Sunday is Mr. Sterling, and that the hateful opinions voiced by that man are those of Mr. Sterling. Accordingly, Effective immediately, I am banning Mr. Sterling for life from any association with the Clippers organization or the NBA. Mr. Sterling may not attend any NBA games or practices. He may not be present at any Clippers facility, and he may not participate in any business or player personnel decisions involving the team. He will also be barred from attending NBA Board of Governors meetings or participating in any other league activity. I am also fining Mr. Sterling $2.5 million, the maximum amount allowed under the NBA Constitution. As for Mr. Sterling's ownership interest in the Clippers, I will urge the Board of Governors to exercise its authority to force a sale of the team and will do everything in my power to ensure that that happens. Oh, you motherfuckers. <laughs> okay. All right. I'm putting cases on all you bitches. Huh? You think you can do this shit? Yay! 
You think you can do this to me? You motherfuckers will be playing basketball in Pelican Bay when I get finished with you. Shoe program, nigga. 23 hour lockdown. I'm the man up in this piece. You'll never see the light of day. Who the fuck you think you fucking with? I'm the police. I run shit here. You just live here. Yeah, that's right. You better walk away. Go on, walk away, because I'm going to burn this motherfucker down. King Kong ain't got shit on me. Do you know that I can pull out the slave ships out of the Bible and show you that the two children of Israel would serve captivity through slave ships? Who are these people?